This is a quick setup and installation video for the Epson ES400 or ES500W document scanner. The 500W is the same thing, it just has Wi-Fi capabilities. This is a great scanner, it can very quickly digitize a whole bunch of documents. It has a power cable with two parts and one USB cable connected to your computer. It's packaged well with styrofoam and tape to make sure that nothing rattles around during shipment. First thing you do when you get it unboxed is connect the power cable, but do not connect the USB cable yet. First thing you're, you're going to want to do is to download the software from the Epson website. Then it'll walk you through a setup procedure and it will tell you when to plug in the USB cable. After turning the unit on, we connect the USB cable when we're instructed to by the software. And then we do a test scan page when instructed by the software. You can register your product if you want for the sake of the warranty. A screen will come up to download some additional software. You definitely want to download the OCR and PDF software to make sure the optical character recognition works so that you can create PDF files of the documents you scan. Now, two different pieces of software will be downloaded. First is Epson Scan 2. This is like the raw utility that does the scanning work. You're not going to actively use that one. Instead, use the Epson Smart Scan app. When you go into settings and scan settings, this is what actually opens the underlying Epson Scan 2 software. But you really want to use the Smart Scan app as your front end. From this, you can scan single sided or double sided. You can save it to your hard drive. And don't forget to switch this option to searchable PDF so the optical character recognition will work and you can copy text from your PDFs and search the text in your PDFs. This is a great little scanner. It works really quick. I've already scanned in 500 documents, saved them to, saved them to my hard drive, backed them up to a second hard drive as well as cloud storage.